Hey, what's going on guys? Mixkilet here, and today I've actually got a pretty exciting new video. We've got some of the rarest CSGO skins that have ever been unboxed that were recently unboxed. One thing before the video starts, in my last video I was talking about the skin.trade website, and there's actually been around $70,000 of skins added onto that site now, so you can definitely check it out. If you're having trouble finding the skins you wanted, there should be a much bigger supply on there. It's actually just a pretty cool site where you can instantly trade all your CSGO skins. A lot of people are using these now, so I'm partnered with one of those sites now. But now onto this video. Gonna be another one of my usual videos covering the best drops from the CSGO majors. This is kind of my second video on the Atlanta major, except this video we've got quite some special rare skins that are not usually unboxed in just about any major. And this, the first one, as you can see right here, is a Souvenir Tech 9 Nuclear Threat Factory New. This is already on a private inventory, so it was actually, you can't really inspect this, but I actually am friends with the guy that bought it, so big thanks to him for sending me the inspect link. Now, I heard this was sold for $3,000. Some people think that's a little bit cheap. I don't really think it's too bad of a trade though because there isn't too many collectors looking for ultra rare tech 9 skins and at the end of the day it's still three thousand dollars for a tech 9 skin although this is a souvenir factor new tech 9 nuclear threat and this is the only one intact that has this with the intact stickers the other souvenir factor new nuclear threat tech 9 um, has all the stickers scraped off it so this one is a lot more valuable it also has a better float and there is still not a p250 but if there's a p250 unboxed I will definitely make a video on that because that will be a one in the world skin and just about the rarest thing ever. But still, Tech 9 is just as rare, just that somehow there's been two of those, but none of the P250s yet. So there's another ultra rare skin unboxed that is not usually unboxed. This is a little bit less rare than the Tech 9. There's been a few of these unboxed, but I think there's only been three or four ever known to exist. A souvenir factory new, uh, pink DD pad. The skin rarely ever comes factory new. So getting it from a souvenir package is super, super unlikely. And I actually really want to buy this myself. I didn't want to buy the Tech 9 really because I've already got the Tech 9 Minimal Wear souvenir that has the All-Star stickers. And I think the All-Star stickers are pretty special and I have like the whole All-Star set. So didn't want to get that skin, but I actually do really want to buy this skin. So you may see it in a Mixkillet inventory update later if I do end up getting it. I'll probably make the guy a pretty big offer, like around $2,000. I believe the other one before this sold for less, so I'm not sure who else is going to try to buy this, but I do want to try to buy it myself, and it does have the signature on the scope. So uh, that's my personal favorite placement for the SOP, so really sick off right here. Hopefully I will be able to get this, but now on to some other skins. So right here we have the Souvenir R8 Amber Fade Factory New. Pretty rare skin, but the demand for this skin is very low. I think they sell for around $500, even though it's an extremely rare skin. But there's also a Souvenir Off Dragon Lore Battle Scarred Unbox. There's also a few more like Souvenir Field Tested, Souvenir Minimal Wear Lores. But I already showed a bunch of those in my last video, and I don't really want to show too many of those. But there's actually a Souvenir Battle Scarred one. I believe Battle Scarred and Well Worn are actually much rarer on the Souvenir Dragon Lores than like Field Tested and Minimal Wear. So I thought I would show this, pretty unique looking, got the happy signature on the scope, and a really beat up souvenir dragon lore. I actually think some of these are kind of cool, and I do think that the value of these, all the souvenir lures are probably going to go down a lot because it seems like there's been a lot unboxed this major. But finally, we've got, I, I looked at the souvenir masterpieces, and I believe the best one unboxed right now was a souvenir field tested one. So here's that one right here from the new major has got the God Scent sticker. The God Scent sticker, I have to say, is actually really sick looking. That is a really cool sticker on the Souvenir Masterpiece right here. But uh, yeah, there hasn't been any factory new or minimal wear ones. If there's a factory new one, that would be pretty insane. That would probably sell for a lot. There's only been a few of those unboxed. But yeah, we've had some pretty good drops this major so far, and hopefully you guys like this video. Make sure to check out skin.trade again. But uh, I'm Mixkillet, and I'm out.